letter V. We will learn to print the uppercase V and the lowercase V. We will talk about the sound that V makes, v, like in Valentine. Do you see the Valentine that I made over here? It says to my Valentine, v, Valentine. Will you be my Valentine? I made a card over here just for you. Before we get started, I'm going to put on my vest. V vest. Vest begins with the letter V, the sound v v vest. Can you think of anything else that begins with the letter V? Do you have a vacuum in your home? Vacuum begins with the letter V. V vacuum. Have you ever seen a volcano? Volcano begins with the letter V. V volcano. Have you ever seen or played a violin? V Violin begins with mm, the letter V. Do you like to eat carrots or corn or peas or broccoli? These are all called vegetables. Mm. Vegetables begins with the letter V. What is the name of something that you put flowers in? You can put flowers in a vase. Some people say vase, and that is spelled V-A-S-E. Vase begins with the letter V. v. And last of all, if you have a lot of people and you're going on a road trip, you might want to ride in a van. Van also begins with the letter V. Okay, we are going to print the letter V and then we're going to practice reading these sentences and putting some words at the end of them that begin with the letter V. So get your markers or your magic printing fingers ready and we are going to print the letter V. So you slant down first, then up like so. Letter V is an upside down volcano and it's ready to blow. So if we flipped it this way, it would be a volcano. So just think of the letter V like a volcano upside down. This is where all the fire and ash comes out, this part. So V is pretty easy to make. You just have to remember that the line is slanted. Okay, it's not a straight line. It's a slanted line this way and a slanted line that way. And the lowercase V is exactly the same, but you're only using the bottom part of the line, the bottom half of the line. So let's make lowercase V. Okay, ready? Slant down first. Then up like so, this upside down volcano is ready to blow. Letter V, letter V makes the sound mm. So when you make that sound, you're putting your, your teeth on the bottom part of your lips, like this, and you're saying mm. Mm. Okay, are you ready to practice these sentences over here? So we're going to read these sentences and we are going to put a word at the end of the sentence that begins with the letter V. So let's read through the sentences first. I will put flowers in a, I will ride in a, I will wear a, I will play a, and I will eat blank. Okay, I'm just gonna move this over just a little bit. Okay, so let's see where we would put our first word. Our first word is violin. So where do you think the word violin is going to go? At the end of which sentence? Well, I know that I don't put flowers in a violin. I know that I don't wear a violin. Hmm, but this makes sense. I will play a violin. So I'm going to put the word violin here at the end of this sentence. Okay, the next word I have is the word van. Do you eat a van? No. 
This would make sense. I will ride in a van. You can go for a ride in a van. Okay, our next word is the word vegetables. Where do you think I'm going to put this word, vegetables? Do you put flowers in vegetables? No. Do you wear vegetables? No. What do you do with vegetables? You eat vegetables. So I'm going to put this word, I will eat vegetables. How about the word vase? Where will I put the word vase? I will put flowers in a vase or I will wear a vase. I will put flowers in a vase. Well, the last one should be easy because there's only one left. And the word is vest. Just like this vest that I'm wearing. It says, I will wear a vest. All right, you can make the letter V with your hands. So all you have to do is go like this with your arms and you're making the letter V. Mm. Or you can take your hands like this and make the letter V. Can you think of any other ways to make the letter V? Maybe you could take two fingers like this and that is the letter V. Okay, until our next letter. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.